I'm Lynn Riggins with WSSC Water. More time at home means we're using more water at home because of COVID-19. Being mindful of your in-home water usage is more important than ever. We all need to keep washing our hands to protect public health, but there are a few things you can do around the house to help conserve water. Checking for toilet leaks is number one on the list. Most toilet leaks are silent. You don't hear the water leaking and you don't see it, yet your toilet is constantly using water. A bad flapper is usually the cause. The seal is no longer tight and the water inside the tank is always filling, meaning your usage will be very high. An average toilet leak can amount to about 200 gallons of water a day. That's 6,000 gallons of water a month. So what does that mean for your bill? A typical family of three would see an extra $325 on their quarterly bill because of just one leaking toilet. It's quick and easy to figure out if you have a toilet leak. All you need is a little food coloring. The first thing you need to do is remove the tank cover. Add a couple drops of food coloring, enough to change the color of the water in the tank. Wait about 15 to 20 minutes, then take a look inside the bowl. If you see the colored water in the bowl, you have a leak. It's a good idea to fix it right away. You can even turn off the water to the toilet in the meantime. If the flapper is the cause of the leak, that's relatively easy to replace yourself, or you can call a WSSC water registered plumber. A good rule of thumb is to check your toilets for leaks twice a year. Perhaps do it when you change the batteries in your smoke detectors. Another tip, if you have a toilet in your basement that isn't used very often, you might want to consider turning it off. That way you don't have to worry about a leak. Remember, we're always here to help you understand your usage and manage your bill. Please visit wsscwater.com understandusage for more conservation tips.